All right, all right, all right, all right. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the talk show live. My name is Simi Kenya, of course. We have amazing, amazing show lined up for you. And my guest in studio this evening is one amazing, amazing super woman. And of course, we are glad to have her on the show and we are going to have an amazing conversation. But before we go to that other side of the show, have you subscribed to our YouTube channel, Simi Kenya TV? Have you uh, followed us on Facebook at Simi Kenya? Or what are you still waiting for? You are watching the best, the best online platform of the Yamarwa Music Award, and of course, you are at the right place. So keep tuning, keep sharing, keep um, uh, inviting your friends so that we can grow as a family and make this even bigger and better. And of course, if you're watching this show, ladies and gentlemen, and you have any form of dental implants, we are here to have a good time and smile. Of course, we are talking about the smile ambassador himself. That is none other than Dr. Shem Rakewa Dental Clinic. If you're watching this show and you have any dental implants, I'm talking about tooth whitening, braces, tooth decay, root canal, or any form of family dentistry. There is only one dental clinic in Kenya right now that has been certified, tested, and approved to give you the best smile that you've always wanted. And that is Dr. Shem Rakewa Dental Clinic, located at Kisumu's Mega City Mall, ground floor next to Dazzly Baba Shop. They give you amazing services. And one thing is that they accept all insurance covers. So if you're watching this show and you have any uh, insurance cover you're using for your medication, ladies and gentlemen, you can use that to visit Dr. Shemra Kewa Dental Clinic and get the smile that you've always wanted. So I want us to go straight to the show. Of course, my guest in studio this evening, like I told you before, is one none other than Phoebe Okobo. Karibu sana. Mm -hmm. How are you? I'm fine. Uko sambamba? Niko sambamba. Aha, now now umetulia kabisa. Mm -hmm. How are you doing? I'm fine. How is uh, life and everything? Life is okay, mm -hmm. though some, somehow hectic, but it's fine. Mm. <laughs> That's so nice. What's, what's, what's so hectic? What's so hard about it? <laughs> maisha tu ya kawaida. Yeah, maisha ya kawaida. Nothing ah. big. Aha. Wow. We are so happy to have you on the show. Watu wengine walikuwa natuliza, mumepata fibi aji. Hmm? Why, why do you think people are thinking it kukupata lingumu? <laughs> I yeah? I can't I can't understand. Sure. Yeah. Wow. So maybe you can introduce yourself officially to our viewers so that at least they can uh, know you from your side as far as we have already introduced you. I'm Tibio Kombo. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm. From Wapi. Nyumbani inakwanga wapi? Migori. Migori duo. Migori, just Migori. Oh, Migori town. Yes. Uh -huh. And then uh, Kisumu. Kisumu is for studies. Uh -huh. I study at Kisumu. Uh -huh. Yeah. Wapi? Riyadh College. Oh, wow, wow, wow. That's amazing. Actually, when we said what we were doing, of course, we had to 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 gani? When we ah, Phoebe ni mstana me soma to pige tu kizugu na kiswahili. I'm okay with any Maybe language. Maybe kijaluwe kipita kidogo tu. I'm okay with any language. Wow. Mm -hmm. Phoebe has been trending at number one for the past three days. Why, why, why do you think you are trending, Mama? I don't understand. If I tell you I don't understand, uh -huh. let the viewers tell me why I'm trending. Why you are trending? Yeah. What people are saying that ulikula 620k ya Jacob, alafu ukamwacha. Jacob akalia sana. Okay. Eh, ni ukweli ama ina. How sure are they? Hmm? How That's sure why we are they? here so that at least you can tell us what's happening. Why do you think uh, ilifika mpaka your name is going out there hmm. that uh, you I mean you did such a thing? You know, people thought, think hmm. that some, a category of people think that you people are cloud chasing. Are you people cloud chasing? No. Mm -hmm. So what is happening? Maybe tell us what's happening. Hey. Hmm? <laughs> How do you want me to tell you? Elaborate. Yeah. Okay. Nini ni nafanyika mpaka ina hmm. imekua hmm. uko njeti hmm. uh, wewe uli kula 620k ya jakom hmm. alafu uka mwaja uka uka potelea. Hmm. Hmm. Can I ask you, did he give me this money once? I'm a, I don't understand. No, na jakom, but okay. sasa, unajua you are, you are the, we can use that word, accused. Okay. Uh -huh. So, ni wewe sasa utuambie, he ni, ni hivi na hivi. Kwaza unajua jakom? Yes. Unamjua? Unamjua. Unamjua kivi. We had, tulikuwa na equal relationship. Uh -huh. Yes. For how long? 2019 up to now. Oh. Yes. And then, uh, up to now. Yes. Which means it is something that is still... Uh, Although yeah. we have differences uh -huh. and sometimes we always take a break uh -huh. and we come back, uh -huh. but 
that that did not that did not mean to cause a lot a lot of drama yes mbona unadhani hii break ya hii time ndio imefanya jacob aka 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 lia sana maybe everyone has is on is on our own way of solving issues mm-hmm. that is maybe is a way mm-hmm. yeah. and uh, did he try reaching you before you went uh, uh, out there and uh, you know uh, did it publicly did he try reaching you so yes he tried reaching me uh-huh. But mm. the situation was I could not handle the situation. It was beyond yes. your your nini. Yes. <laughs> so uh he decided to do that. How did you feel about it? Oh. Anyway, I felt a lot of frustrated. Mm-hmm. Uh, I didn't yani I didn't expect him to do that. Mm-hmm. Uh, and then now did you try reaching him kumuliza eh naona naona kipindi kingine hapa nje. <laughs> oh. Nimekuaje? <laughs> After that I I was in shock. Mm-hmm. I didn't reach him by that time. Mm-hmm. Yes. Absolutely. I could not understand. I was very disappointed in him. Mm. Mm. How far did you are you know coming together gone? Did it reach the family level where your family knows him, his family knows you and all that? Ama ilikuwa tu ya yetu ya nje ya kawaida. He has never come into our home. Uh-huh. Yes, that we are legally married. Uh-huh. It is boyfriend and girlfriend. Uh-huh. Yes. Oh, sio ile ndoa eti. Eh, uh, it's officially. Na wewe umefika kwao? Although I've been to their place, uh-huh. but uh-huh. we are not yet married. Uh-huh. Yes. Wow. So, um when he talked about uh 620,000 yes. that he had spent on you yes. to go to school. Uh first of all, is he the one who has been sponsoring your education? No, uh-huh. I'm a job student. Uh-huh. And also I apply help loan. Uh-huh. Yes. Uh-huh. Yes, he has never sponsored my education. Uh-huh. Yes. And why do you think he, he came up with that uh, ideology that he has been actually unajua huko nje inasemekana ni yeye alipeleka shule ki alitoa pesa sijui aliuza nini nyumbani akakupeleka shule kama bibi yake usome. Now this is the story. Mm. After kusoma mm. two months to your graduation I don't know when you graduated or when your graduation <laughs> is supposed to be mm. but two months to your graduation mm. you showed up mm. with uh, another man and you abandoned him. Mm. Mm-hmm. First of all we don't have graduation. Mm-hmm. Second I'm still ongoing. Mm-hmm. I'm still studying. Mm-hmm. That one is a scam. That 620 is a scam. Mm-hmm. Yes. So what has he been doing to appoint that E6 620k hmm. ili kuja aje hii hesabu yake inakuja aje according to you it is beyond imagination mm-hmm. yes because one you are saying he's not sponsoring your education i have evidence he's not sponsoring my education uh-huh. yes i can give you ama ni easy ma to rent to nini to upkeep although he had been paying my rent mm-hmm. but he was paying for his daughter mm-hmm. his, his, his daughter was living there his mm-hmm. daughter was mm-hmm. living there mm-hmm. Yes. So ni ni mtoto wake ama mtoto wenu? I think that is a father duty is yeah. to take care of his child. Oh, so you people mm. even have a, a daughter? Yes, we have a daughter. Oh, so which means that was like uh he was fulfilling his father duty. Uh-huh. Yes. And not <laughs> and not and not sponsoring his girlfriend. Yes. <laughs> and second, mm-hmm. I don't think that it's can it it's that huge amount. Uh-huh. That is a scam. He's just a mere teacher, mm-hmm. a mere primary teacher. Mm-hmm. Not even a uh, high school teacher. Not teacher. even ajaandikwa na serikali bado. Mm-hmm. Sasa mm-hmm. you can imagine the amount is being paid mm-hmm. with that ma- that 620. Mm-hmm. It's far beyond from reality. But maybe for four years it can amount to No. Mm-hmm. We were in the session 2019. Mm-hmm. 2020 was corona. Everyone was at home. Mm-hmm. We didn't go to school. Yeah. 2021 tulikuwa mm-hmm. session. Yeah last year. Uh, yes, 21 21 last year. Yeah. 2022 ndio mm-hmm. isai. Can that sum up to 20, that amount? Mm-hmm. For real? Up to 620k. It's a scam. Mm-hmm. Even me, mm-hmm. I pay for those rent. Uh-huh. So see eti ni anapiga issue yeah. kila kila. I pay for those rent. Mm-hmm. I have parents who support me. Uh-huh. They even they, sometimes they pay for the daughter school fee. Uh-huh. Yes. Oh, ya mtoto ameanza kwenda shule. Ameanza kwenda shule uh, at 2 years. Oh. Mm. Ama hii hii story ya uh, 620 pia ni ni hiyo story ya mtoi kwenda shule. <laughs> the daughter is learning from a cheap school. Mm. Eh hey, mimi is a cheap school that you go. <laughs> na ni yako na mtoi ama wewe? Ni mimi. Uh-huh. Yes. But uh, sasa kama mtumekana hapo 
2021 sai 2022. Yes. Mbona why do you think because ni mtu unajua? Ni mtu unajua. Na anakujua. Uh. Why do you think? Ah uh. uh, ni nini unadhani ili push akaenda mpaka huko nje kufanya venye alifanya? The man first was drunk. Uh-huh. Yes. Oh. Yes, if how you sh- see how sh- If you see those cl- videos clearly, the man is drunk. Uh-huh. Yes. And is out mm-hmm. kuniharibia jina. Mm-hmm. Yes. Mbona unadhani anakuri akonje kukuharibia jina? That is I think that is the question you should ask him, not me. Uh-huh. Yes. But um, you are saying that uh, you people have a difference. And from his allegation, he mm. said that you abandoned him mm. and moved on. Hey, moving on, yeah. I can't tell you I've moved on or not. Mm-hmm. I haven't to move on. Uh-huh. I'm just I'm just waiting for that perfect ideal man of mine huyo mwenye anataka nikae naye i'm just waiting for that uh-huh. eh yeah. na mbona sio yeye si yeye pia anaweza kuwa huyo ideal man si alisema it have moved on uh-huh. sasa si natamani huyo kijana mwenye anataka nikae na yeye <laughs> vijana mnatamaniwa mkuje mujitete <laughs> All right, all right, ladies and gentlemen, we are having an amazing conversation here with uh, Phoebe Okombo. Phoebe has been on, uh, you know, internet. Her issue has all been on internet. People have been talking about her, claiming that after a viral video of uh, Mr. Stanley, yeah. right? Yeah. Of Mr. Stanley, uh, went viral when Mr. Stanley was actually wailing and uh, complaining that Phoebe had abandoned her after he has been uh, sponsoring your uh, life and education for four good years so all these things happened did your family uh, all these four years umesema hujaend kwao yeye pia hajaenda kwani lakini si familia ilijua mko pamoja not many people uh-huh. but a bit but a bit yeah. now the few uh-huh. wali walichukulia je history venye ilienda huko nje They were disappointed. Uh-huh. Yes. And did they try reaching him maybe kumuliza mbona tunaona hii shughuli imeenda hivi mpaka mtandaoni? I I think they tried reaching him wao kumpata online. Uh-huh. Yes. Na we una feel aje? Do you think you did a good thing to Jacob? I I'm even wondering what I did. Uh-huh. That man didn't sponsor my education. Mark me right, he didn't sponsor my education. Uh-huh. I'm under job. Uh-huh. I get government capitation. Uh-huh. Um, napata help loan uh-huh. anyone can confirm with the riat institute yeah i'm clean on that uh-huh. he has never spent on me on my education uh-huh. yes ni tu ishughuli ya kawaida ishughuli ya kawaida uh-huh. and that is gambling that mm-hmm. is like gambling <laughs> <laughs> why do you think it's gambling <laughs> don't you take girls on dates no we do and are you are you out yeah really hmm? why don't you wait See, and shout. Pengine, pengine, okay. Mm. You see, whatever is happening, mm. maybe Jacob in his mind knew that you are husband and wife. Mm. And did you also have the same in mind that you people are like husband and wife? You know, she got he got me when I was naive. Uh-huh. Yes. He could have just given me time kidogo. Three years, four years. No, not that. He uh-huh. could have just given me time kidogo. Uh-huh. Then I finish my education then we see what next is mm-hmm. willing to the whole world uh-huh. yes when are you finishing your education not now not now yes tumebaki na kamwaka hivi ama no 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 mm. just just ridhika na you answer not now because mm. unajua maybe tunaweza mm. ona kama si mbali sana mm. at least angoje mumalize hii story si mbali mm. not that far mm-hmm. yes and do you believe when you lifika you people can solve your differences or rather the issues and mend things and things just come down that man has pride and ego mm-hmm. yes why do you say so? if he can go out there and shout and talk to the whole world mm-hmm. and even vitu zenye afanyi mm-hmm. yes that is far beyond imagination mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. so you don't think up to that point unaweza suluhisha mambo ikwe sambamba but uh, maybe maybe with a good talk mm-hmm. not just a talk yeah because mm-hmm. you know Mm. Uh life sometimes come with emotions yes that may end up frustrating someone so unaweza pata maybe apart from you saying he was drunk mm. maybe he was emotionally broken mm. um trying to imagine or uh, imagining that maybe kuna kamtu kanawasumbua mahali mm. and uh, he got mad and maybe tried reaching you mu tatue and it didn't work so he thought going out there could could uh, to solve it 
and people are really sympathizing with him have you had wewe pia hata huko shuleni wanafunzi wamejaribu kukwambia it no wanafunzi wanajua identity is money see they they confirm with the school they know yes so all along ako wapi all along yeye akifanya hii shughuli yote ikifanyika yeye anakwanga wapi migori na wewe uko shule so how often do you people uh, How not, often do you go to Migori or how Not often? that often. Because there were also uh, claims mm. that at some point mlikuwa mnaishi na yeye hapa Riyadh. Yes ne. Na na mkakaa mm. pamoja. He has never mm-hmm. kuishi huko. Mm-hmm. He comes and visit mm-hmm. and go. Mm-hmm. I He comes Friday mm-hmm. visit mm-hmm. and he aende. Mm-hmm. He has never stayed with me. Yeah. Yeah. Na wewe? Mm. Kama tuseme sahi. Mm because wengine walikuwa nasema oh Phoebe amekula pesa ya Jacob nini nini sasa hii tuseme hmm. sasa Jacob anafaa kurudishiwa pesa yake ametumia inaweza kuwa ngapi <laughs> approximately approximately yeah. not approximately uh-huh. just go for a safari kum uende customer care uh-huh. you get the correct answer uh-huh. don't approximate things lakini inaweza gonga ngapi Mian don't mili? no 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 don't approximate things uh-huh. just go for us i'm very free uh-huh. Feel free. But sasa wewe ndio unajua kwa sababu unasema hiyezi fika 620. That is a scam. Mm-hmm. Kwani anafanya kazi wapi yenye nimefika 620 mm-hmm. and 2020 lost his job. Oh. Yes. Uh-huh. 2021. 2021 ndio aka, akaingia aka, akaingia kwa shule nyingine tena. Mm-hmm. Oh like when you people met he was already a teacher. Mm. Uh-huh. But 2020 he lost his job. He lost his job. Yeah. Then 2021 akapata job place mm-hmm. fulani hey. but as a teacher still. Hey. Hey. Uh-huh na radio ulipata kama kwa radio Ayuko Royal Media mm-hmm. you just go there for a talk mm-hmm. yeah mm-hmm. na hii mambo bana hii mambo sisi tunaona tu mtatu mm-hmm. hii mambo hii cause mm-hmm. you know why i'm saying that he came for drama mm-hmm. how can a teacher a well trained teacher mm-hmm. ako na helmet see that is drama <laughs> itself <laughs> that is Wajua, drama is apunai, apunai that yakom. See maybe ni It's engineer. mysterious. No, uh-huh. that is mystery. So maybe for safety. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. That means uh-huh. he came for war. Uh-huh. Yes. Na hii shughuli ilifanyika wapi? Ali kama di shule. Uh-huh. A, he caused the drama. Uh-huh. Akarudi kwa nyumba, akachukua nyumba hapa. Eh, penye yeah. tuna, tulikuwa tunaishi. A, he took everything. Uh-huh. So, I'm I'm even shocked bana nataka ni nimlipe pesa yenye hata sijui uh-huh. na yeye amechukua vitu zake zote. Mhm. Uh-huh. Huh? Hold on. Ladies and gentlemen, we are live on the talk show live. My name is Simi Kenya of course. We are live with Tekasi 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 Tulia Tulia Tulia. We are live with Phoebe Okombo. Of course, ladies and gentlemen, if you are watching this show and you are wondering where this beautiful background is, we are live from the beautiful, the amazing, lovely Garden Homes in Kisumu. Lovely Garden Homes gives you amazing accommodation. They give you amazing um meals, amazing um Uh, a garden they have a beautiful garden like where we are right now that gives you the best serenity the best look and the best experience of a lifetime so if you are looking for a place to have a good time a place to create your memories a place to enjoy your moments a place to just um enjoy every time that you spend in the lakeside city of kisumu visit the lovely garden uh, guest home they are on social media at lovely garden guest home or lgg Uh, hke on instagram of course giving you amazing services they have both um uh, stays and uh, you know uh, uh, if you want to take long stays and short stays they have half board and you know full board they have uh, bed and breakfast of course at a very very affordable price giving you the best exquisite the best deluxe and the best standard experience of a lifetime make sure you visit this beautiful facility the lovely garden guest home and get the best experience that you've always wanted and that is where we are right now ladies and gentlemen having an amazing conversation with uh Phoebe Okombo herself so umesema Jacob Jacob alikuja shule aka piga nduru yes akaenda kwa nyumba Aka, akachukua vitu zake hii time yote wewe ulikuwa nilikuwa kwa shule uh-huh. yes how did you manage or rather feel about all what was happening at that time so i told you that that, that thing, the whole situation was disappointing mm-hmm. frustrating mm-hmm. but you have to take like the way it is mm. yes alafu ukatoka hapo ukaenda kwa nyumba yes uh-huh. ukapata jacob amechukua vitu zake yes in, in fact he messed up the house mm-hmm. but i was just fine with that mm-hmm. so yes. ulikuwa kwa nyumba hiyo time no uh-huh. mm. 
na unajua ndio hii kitu ifike mm. mpaka Jacoma toke migori mm. akuje riat mm. aingie shuleni mm. apige hii drama a, aende kwa nyumba achukue vitu he must have been disappointed ni nini ilimudi hivyo kiasi hey. so i told you that man came from for drama someone coming from migori with an helmet mm-hmm. yet is a not a teacher mm-hmm. is is a teacher not a that kind engineer mm-hmm. It's first a drama. Mm-hmm. He came out for drama mm-hmm. and that is what he, he wanted. Mm. Yes. Mbona unadhani alikuja hii drama after four years? Mbona hakukuja hii drama last year ama 2020 ama 2019? I can't answer that. It's beyond my mm. That is beyond me. I can't answer. Mm. Yes. It's okay. So um wow. <laughs> These guys are eh? So many people are watching here and it's an amazing conversation of course um eh according wacho ni ya ya comment ya kuonjo engineer all right mm-hmm. Clarice, we always give a shout out to our viewers Rehema Julius is watching uh, Fever Makomuga Makomoga is watching Julie Kevins is watching Akinyi um, Umala is watching uh hum Dero Nyakwarolero is watching wah wow. Wilberforce uh, hey so many people are watching so Right now it's already out there mm-hmm. that wewe kama Phoebe ume disappoint Jacob. What can you say about the the perspective or rather the idea that people already have out there towards you? <laughs> that uh, wewe ni mkula mali ya mtu na kumtoroka. Sasa mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Even those viewers. Si mtu mwenye ako na 600k ina ina kunekananga. Pesa uongea, jatulia. Ukweli. Pesa jatulia. 600k if you if you see if I see you it represents you. Surely guys ina represent kweli. Si unaona ni si, si kuna wenye wale 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 No. Wale, wale no. Wale wale no 600 600 kama hii kitu sio 600 dingapi i don't know i don't know but that man is a scam that mm. no uh-huh. yes and how, how do you feel as a parent as a co-parent yes. now that you are the do- you have a daughter and the daughter is part of you and also part of his side and uh, issue issue imetokea hmm. how do you feel as a parent as maybe a pa- for your daughter and as a kid grow siku moja aingie mtandao ni As a daughter, mm. as a parent, I mm. have to be strong for her. Mm-hmm. Yes. With time, mm-hmm. she will learn. Mm-hmm. She will learn these things. Mm. Yes. Na sasa hii, eh, mkikutana na Jacob. Eh. Mnaweza fanya hivi. Wewe mwenyewe unaweza fanya hivi. I'm a peaceful woman. Mm-hmm. If if he wants dialogue, I'm a, peace, a very peaceful woman. Mm. I miss that is why the first when that thing hit the media first, mm-hmm. I pulled out from the media. Mm-hmm. I didn't want to cause drama mm. yes mm-hmm. because people were misjudging me yeah. they were they were saying what they don't know mm-hmm. yeah actually that's why i had to look for you because mm. there is always, always two sides of the story mm. jacob claimed that uh, he sponsored you and you disappointed him by showing up with another man mm. after i mean two uh, two months to your graduation mm. so we had to get you also to hear from your side of which you have said Jacob has never sponsored your education. Yes. He has only done his fatherly duties yes. by, you know, chipping in and giving some upkeep for you and uh, the daughter. Uh, you have also said that your graduation is not yet as he was claiming. Yes. Two, uh, four, you have said that you didn't show up with another man yes. towards your graduation. Yes. Uh-huh. The so, fake graduation, just saying the fake graduation. Uh-huh. The fake graduation. And <clears throat> after all this I know you have friends. Yes. He also have friends. Yes. Who knew you? Uh, when you were jua mko pamoja, maybe you used to know the two of you, mm. mutual friends. Yes. Um have they tried reaching the two of you so that at least you people can sort your things under water without going public out there? You know, mm. I've not tried reaching him anyway. Mm-hmm. Why? Yes. I just wanted to give him time for the drama mm-hmm. akimaliza mm-hmm. if he can come mm-hmm. we can talk but not now mm-hmm. let him finish up with the drama mm-hmm. yes why do you call this thing drama it's a dramatic mm-hmm. have you seen this show going vir- viral mm-hmm. akisema mm-hmm. he show niliwash- he, this is a drama mm-hmm. niliwasilisha have you seen that thing no 
there's another clip yes. of the same yes mm-hmm. yeye yeah, akisema yeah, eti mm-hmm. hii kitu inaendelea eh, uh-huh. alifanya ni drama uh-huh. yes but kama alifanya ni drama mm. drama anaweza kuja mpaka pige kelele shuleni mpaka aende achukue vitu See, I told you that man was not sober uh-huh. yes that is why kuna clip ili nini that this show is this thing i did it uh-huh. niliwa it was in kiswahili uh-huh. niliwasilisha i drama uh-huh. uh, alisema hiyo yes. after ile ya kwanza yes I, alieka, it, it was quoted uh-huh. yes na sasa uh, venye sasa hii alikuja shuleni uh-huh. kuna kitu ningependa tueleze kidogo uh-huh. venye alifika shuleni uh-huh. uh, akatoka migori uh-huh. akakuja riat mlipatana kwanza ama yeye alikuja tu akaenda shuleni hapo katikati ilikuwa aje on his way to migori did you people talk did you know he was coming uh, did you communicate before i knew he was coming uh-huh. yeah, it, it was coming uh-huh. yes kufika hapo uh-huh. we had a misunderstanding alifika mpaka kwa nyumba eh, uh, ama eh, alifika tu kwa shule alifika kwa nyumba we had a misunderstanding uh-huh. after that misunderstanding uh-huh. akaniambia nachukua vitu zake of which i was very come very it's okay uh-huh. si mimi nikamwacha amecha pack vitu zake anaenda uh-huh the the man came to school mm-hmm. to cause those drama mm-hmm. in fact he came to beat me in school mm-hmm. yes that is why alifungiwa pale nje mm-hmm. he came wakamwambia mm-hmm. school institution uwezi piga mtu mm-hmm. yes so yeye alikujia vita according to you yes he came for anyways came for war na hii war mbona mkumaliza kwa nyumba see we had finished akaniambia naenda uh-huh. yes and then uh, ukaenda shule yes uh-huh. and where was uh, the daughter The daughter is not around. Okay. Yes. So which means it was just the two of you. Yes. Okay. So <coughs> we ukaenda shuleni eh. ndio akakuja. Eh, sasa mimi mm. naambiwa there is a commotion out. Mm-hmm. Yes. Na watu wa shule wale kuna wenye walikuwa wanamjua? Yes, many people know him. Ah. Yes. Uh-huh. So hao ndio wakakuja wakakwambia huko nje ni kubaya. Ni kubaya. Alafu wewe ukafanya nini? I just smile, nothing big. Ah. So what You know everyone has his way of responding to problems. Uh-huh. Yes. So you can pick a smile pale. Yeah, I had no option. Mm-hmm. Then uka ukaenda did you mlionana kweli? No. Kwa nini? Si kama mtu wako ungerudi uko huko nje umwambie nani acha kufanya hivi. The At guy was The guy was hey, you could not come in down that time. Mm-hmm. See that is why nimekwambia wacha afanye drama mm-hmm. akimaliza he will come back to his senses mm-hmm. and say these things are is that 620k is a scam mm-hmm. mm. na <coughs> sahi mm. umesema for how long do you think this drama is going to last kama mtu unajua because ni mtu umekaa mna mnajuana oh because you are calling it drama that it means there is there is some point <laughs> atafika atulie we ni bina, binadamu ni mpaka atatulia tu mm-hmm. yes yeah. Yeah. So from now huh. in case he tries reaching you out. Huh. Kwaambie mama ah uh, ilishafanyika naona tuendelee hivi na hivi tufanye hii mambo yetu tuendelee venye tulikuwa. I can only talk with him at police station. Why? The girl if I tell you the guy is wild. Mm-hmm. Had he assaulted you before? Ama hapo nyuma kulikuwa na amewahi kuwa na vita yoyote? Yes. Uh-huh. yes. To what extent? tulikuwa na vita and i think that is person i uh-huh. that is personal kidogo uh-huh. mm. that's why you you think it is the same thing that is happening though now it is public yes uh-huh. so why do you think police station you have friends you mm. have uh, associates mm. you have people see maybe mm. i think police station could be good uh-huh. because when he makes drama there uh-huh. at a pal- anini he will be sorted uh-huh. yes and na, why do you think we we una makosa Mbona una dalili yeye yako na makosa? Wacha nikwambie, yeah. to error is to human. Uh-huh. Yes. Yeah. And people are too big. Uh-huh. You should not go social media way. Uh-huh. Social media way you cannot solve anything. Yeah. In fact it was in the situation. Mhm. Mm. Yeah. You could have just call me and we go for a dialogue. Uh-huh. Kwani mimi ni si mimi binadamu. Mhm. Uh-huh. Mm. Yeah. Na maybe dialogue ndio ilikata lakini mm. uh, I don't think police station ndio itaweza sana mkitatua mambo yenu. Uh, no. Mm. Mnajua sahii sahii mkirudiana venye hiyo mapenzi inaweza kuwa tight. 
Sindemana na ile Diana anasemanga iti kama kifuniko ya gas. Hii si, sasa itakuwa gas yenyewe. Si nime ndio maana nimekwambia eh. I cannot talk to you with him alone. Uh -huh. Yes. But when people come together and make sure that you people get back you can listen. That is a story for another day. No 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 no. That no, is a story for another no, day. No 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 no. Unajua eh. hii mambo imesharibika huko nje. Mambo imeharibika ndio maana nimekwambia I need to cool off. I have so many things in my brain. Mm. Yes. And the situation with the, with this time yeah. I can't make any proper decision. Mm -hmm. I need time. Yeah. Do you think you have lost friends because of this or other people around you? In fact or... I have supportive friends. Uh -huh. Yes. I have very good friends. Mm -hmm. So how do they help you handle the situation? Because you know, at this point, some people will even think you'll run away. Some people will even think you'll disappear. <laughs> some people will even think that you will not even, you know, go to school. Mm -hmm. And how, how do you help manage the situation with all the uh, pressure out there? Oh, mm -hmm. I have very good friends. Mm -hmm. First, I have to appreciate Val. Yeah. She's my best friend. Mm -hmm. She will comfort me. Yeah. She will just tell me yeah. everything is will be all right. Mm -hmm. Wherever everything, mm -hmm. I have. They are good. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And they never judge me. Yeah. Ata kama ni mfanya makosa, they will never judge me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nasai, unaona na shule, shule. How did the school handle the situation? Being that this thing, this thing happened at the school. Oh, mm. the school have the record. They know the guy didn't pay that fee. Mm -hmm. Yes. They know the guy didn't pay that, that fee. Mm -hmm. mana, I, I could have even been suspended kama it was real. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. So which means the teachers also knows what, what, what is happening. Yes, the guy, if, if that thing was real, that mm -hmm. I had squandered that money, mm -hmm. I could have been suspended, mm -hmm. but I didn't squander the money. Mm -hmm. Yes. And for, for now onwards, Will you, what do you think of his support now? Because we say mapale nyuma, hame kuwa kishu, ulikia mambo yake, kama mzazi and all that, but sasa, uko nje kumearibika. Do you, are you still going to look for that nini from him? Or rather call him, pengine kukeumana, maybe mtoto anaitaji hina, hina, hina. Do you really think, uh, if he how can, are you going to handle it? If he cannot support the baby, I'm very fine with that. It's okay mm -hmm. if he cannot. Mm -hmm. Yes, I want, I, I want, I want still to pick a duro. Mm -hmm. Yes. We would pick a duro. I'm a strong woman. <laughs> I hustle. Yeah. Yes. Oh, so mm -hmm. which means apart from going to school, there is something. Yes, I hustle. Uh -huh. Yeah. Wow, wow, wow. Na uzanga nguo. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh, apo tu shule ni ama? Apo tu shule. Ndiyo mana ni mekombia, I can support that baby. Mm. Yes. Wow. <laughs> uh -huh. Let me, let me, all right. Let me see what's happening here. So many people are watching. And the show is really nice. So many people are watching. Wow. <clears throat> Koro. Adwa ni mundo watiki. Kwa ni mundo wadhi mangenya inya. Okay. Koro. <clears throat> Phoebe. Yes. Gisani. Uweche use wachore. Mm. And uh, a group of people who are really supporting you. Kange wacho ni gini na kwa mja ni marifi. To ya kwa mbende nitie joma wacho ni tie. Do you know nitie nyaka joma sani o heti ya heta ma gima isete monegi honge. But because of the story, gine ni kangat moro manotimo makosa moro madugu. Begi ni osebedo ka mi stress, esomo, katetiji and all that. No. Mm -hmm. I can those those are little stress. Mm -hmm. See as yacha kusoma juiti this this thing going viral viral. Mm -hmm. That is I'm stupid upstairs. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But it's so it's a lot of pressure. It's not a lot Una of pressure. Aje, uki nje Facebook, and, ama uinge WhatsApp and, and kila mali ni fibi, 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 fibi. Una, how do you how do you manage? I know how to handle everything. Eh. Yes. See I told you I just smile about it. What's and your cause? Social work and everything will be all right. Uh -huh. Yes. Wow. And right now, uh, you as a, a mom, Jacom is there, and uh, hopefully, people are trying to mend things between you. In Enoka Nisani, are you planning to move on? Kusini Amwani do a bit of single? Kusuin, what are you up to? So I told you that decision I can't make at for now. Mm -hmm. I still have some things to focus on. Mm -hmm. Yes. Eh, lakini venye mapenzi ni tamu si utafute tu mutu ya kupiga na yu sherea sayi ukitoa na yu. 
I cannot make any decision as per now. Mm. I need my head need to clear off. Mm -hmm. Yes. And saying that your head needs to clear off, mm. it means the pressure is too much. Not the pressure. I have a lot of things. Mm. This is not the only thing I'm focusing on. I'm focusing on many things. Mm. Yes. Na kama history ni ukweli. Pengine maybe siku moja jakoma toke na records. You maybe anaweza ona aseme huyo msichana anadanganya, niko na records si na hii na hii na hii. Uta 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 utajitetea. I have I have my records. See, I told you if you even if you have evidence I have. He has never paid my school fee. Mm -hmm. Yes. If you if you're okay, just go that you go check. Mm -hmm. I'm very fine with that. Yeah. Yes. Wow. That's amazing. So right now, to everyone who has been thinking otherwise about you, when you are wakiku, wana kama mtu konman, kwanza wa madem, walisema, the next uh, women conference, wewe di utakuwa main speaker. Ebu ongea na wawo. Usha chagulewa, wewe ndio main speaker. Next men, female. <laughs> Alafu wamesema jakom, next men's conference, ya atakai chini ya chukue notes. So, ebu ongea na speak to your fellow ladies oh mm. i can tell them let nothing pin them down mm -hmm. whoever holds nothing yeah. fears nothing mm -hmm. i don't that that money is a scam mm. i am not to be to be blamed for his downfall mm -hmm. that is its personal pro problem mm -hmm. yes wow na sasa mm. tungependa pia uongee na wale wanaume wamekuwa wakikuchukia juu ya hii story mm. yeah maybe you can just tell them something oh wanaume wananichukia eh, kuna wenye wanakuchukia wanasema huyo msichana hata afai kuwa uhai saa hii kuna oh. wenye wanasema huyo msichana alifanya vibaya mimi ningekuwa huyo jamaa saa hii huyo msichana sijui angekuwa wapi eh uogopi oh siogopi eh? sio gopi kwa nini si kukula hiyo pesa ndio maana mm. sio gopi sio gopi kabisa <laughs> and wanaume yes. stop misjudging someone when you don't know the other part of the story uh, yes <laughs> so which means i mm. people should know that you are clean yes i'm very clean you are going on with your studies very much and your life is going on and moving on and uh hauna shida na sasa do you think kuna graduate yote na jacob Oh, see, I told you I'm very calm man. Mm. Yani hizo vitu zenye maybe unaweza vitu zenye alifa asijamshikilia. Mm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Vitu si nimekwambia uweva mwenye ana anachu mimi sina chuki na yeye. <laughs> yes. So na sasa hii yeah. ukisikia eti ame move on yeye amepata mtu. Oh. Yeah. Aki move on. Mm. That is his business. Yes. Wewe sikia ni kama kauchu ngu fulani eti sasa mtu mlikuwa na yeye ame move on. Oh nitasikia uchungu eti ame move on aje. Yeah. Si unajua tulipatana tukiwa wakubwa. Yeah. Yes. Uh -huh. Sio I told you I know how to hold to every pressure. Yeah. Nothing pins me down. Hata uh -huh. kiwa uh -huh. It's okay with me. Yes. So in gichunyi eh uh igonye -huh. tuolo. Agonye tuolo. Onyalo he can do every wherever he wants. Uh -huh. Whatever uh -huh. at any time. Yeah. Kendo yonge kwa degi wach mara. Kabisa. Eh issue mano timoreni ni ngono na yake ndio yonge kwa degi watch mara mara. Eh aonge kwa degi watch mara mara. And did you get any advice from people rather maybe did you be uh, get advice at some point to maybe go and sue him for uh, um keto nyingi kakiwacho na and all that. Oh. Hmm? I got so many advices. Yeah. To go and sue him. Mm -hmm. Yaani kumfanyia vitu mingi. Mm -hmm. But for the respect that I have for him. Mm -hmm and mimi siku kula hiyo pesa mm -hmm. ndio maana mm -hmm. i cannot go mm -hmm. but if he wants if he takes this thing further mm -hmm. i can go a step ahead mm -hmm. yes unajua ulifanya slogan nyingine ikatembea hapa nje timoni chendo yes. did you see it yes eh? mm -hmm. how did you how did you feel about about you coming <laughs> making people to come up mpaka wengine wakasema moni chendo lakini fipi chendo sasa hivi <laughs> <laughs> you know eh? many people many people don't know the, the kind of Phoebe they are thinking about. Uh -huh. They think that this Phoebe yeah. is a very classy woman. Mm -hmm. yeah. But you are classy, you look good. Not really. Uh -huh. We Phoebe is just a student, just a mere student. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, what just a na, struggler. What you are going to that you 620 kama Ay, ule, eh? my life has changed. <laughs> Mimi bado ni ule ule tu mio hiyo pesa pana. Wewe ulisema watu wakasema eh Eh. Monchendo. 
lakini eh. vipi chendo sasa hivi <laughs> <laughs> wow <clears throat> let's see what's happening here <laughs> hey. wanasema fibi ako na confidence hmm? Bona uko na confidence hivi na watu wanasema wewe ulikula pesa ya jako. Oh, see I never see kula hiyo pesa. <laughs> And that confidence mm-hmm. it was is, is what makes a woman. <laughs> wow. Koro jogyo se loko ni chuo chendo lakini jako chendo. Eh ya. So These people are funny. Eh? Our viewers are always funny and interesting. I love them so much. That's why we always ask them, who do you want us to bring on the show? And they always tell us, tulete nani, tulete. Actually ni wao waliniambia nitafute uh Phoebe. So right now, yes. you see <clears throat> one week ago you are not as popular as you are this week. True or false? True. One week ago you could do your things normally you could go anywhere normally you could do your things without um being bothered by people around you and all that but you see right now the status has changed you are one person you will go to the supermarket and feel like who you you live be i know it's already yes. uh, happening hmm? so unaonaje how are you going to handle this new phoebe that is known mm-hmm. everywhere that is uh, a celebrity out there mm. and also a celebrity for eating jacom's money which you personally have said you have not eaten so yeah. how are you going to handle this new status oh. because uh, it's it might be quite challenging you it came out actually overnight nikitu au kwa una expect so how are you going to manage this new oh. mm. this ni, ni, this new phoebe will just embrace change mm-hmm. yes and take things the way they are mm-hmm. Yeah. Na sasa are you in for any business with your brand or for any tuseme sasa hii mtu aseme eh huyu ndio yule fibi huyu fibi tunataka tu tu akwe brand ambassador wa hii nini have you got a few people who want you to do that for them? No. Mm. Yeah. Na ukipata sasa hii. I'm okay. Eh. Yeah. Waseme bei yako ni 620k. So I want us to wind up. Yeah. And of course uh, before you wind up there is a uh, We have something called the grill. We are going to go to that. So ladies and gentlemen, this is the talk show live. My name is Simi Kenya. We are chilling here having a good time with the amazing Phoebe. If you are watching this show and you are wondering what's going on, we are live from the beautiful, maybe you are asking yourself this beautiful background, this new uh, home of course. This is the lovely garden guest home. If you are watching this show ladies and gentlemen and you want a place to chill, a place to have a good time, a place to create your memories, a place to have an amazing moment, a place to enjoy each and every time you can always visit a uh, lovely garden guest home uh, kisumu they are located uh, near riyadh uh, just some few kilometers from kisumu uh, uh, from the cbd and they give you amazing services accommodation best meals uh, best uh, serenity environment a cool and uh, a secret uh, garden they give you the best posh view of the uh, Uh, Lake Victoria of course the sun uh, sunset uh, it's also amazing so it's amazing and that's why we call it home away from home wherever you visit LGGH or lovely garden guest home you are always be rest assured to be uh, to know that you are home away from home and of course if you're watching this show we've been having an amazing moment courtesy of the best dental clinic in Kenya right now if you're watching this show ladies and gentlemen and you have any dental implants you can smile confidently you can enjoy each and every moment of your laughter because the confidence is down we tell you confidence is key you must hear what we confidence confidence is key and every time you're smiling every time you are uh, giving out a laugh out there it should be with confidence that confidence can only be brought by the best dental clinic in Kenya right now certified tested and approved to give you the best smile that you've always wanted is Dr Shem Rakewa Dental Clinic they are located at Kisumu's Mega City Mall and open every Monday to Saturday from 8 a.m. to 5 PM and one good thing is that they accept insurance covers all insurance covers APA AON NHIF UAP um old mutual and all all insurance covers they accept them and one good thing is that once you visit Dr Shemra Kewa Dental Clinic you live smiling happy and ready to face the world with confidence in your smile so i want us to wind up and as we uh, wind up uh huh 
sioni sioni swali leo eh sioni swali leo ai wa 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 sioni swali leo so as we wind up phoebe yes maybe your daughter yes. will one day grow and as they say that internet never forgets she may one day have an opportunity to watch what happened yes. and maybe to watch this interview whereby you are here uh, are talking about the whole thing as far as your side is concerned what can you tell her oh yeah when she grow up yeah see i told you you, you just prepare her psychologically yeah and she will just have to accept reality because mm-hmm. this thing social media never forgets mm-hmm. yes yeah so how 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 are you going to how are you going to tell her so that in future mm. she might not chukia dad or chukia you because oh. of maybe a simple misunderstanding that happened between the two you know yeah. how how the daughter will be brought up yeah. will matter a lot mm-hmm. yes mm-hmm. and then uh, as we wind up maybe there's something you really want to address or talk about as we as we wind up the whole thing. Oh. Ile kitu nasikia unafaa sasa ku kuweka pale nje. Oh. Kwanza yeah. as people are saying that Phoebe chamo pesa na mm-hmm. that is not the the that Phoebe. Yeah. Sijakula pesa ya mtu. Mm-hmm. Yes, yeah, sijakula hiyo pesa ya mtu. Mm-hmm. And for people judging me yeah. It's far away from reality. Stop mm-hmm. misjudging me. Yeah. Yes. In fact, as per now I'm financially down. Mm-hmm. Sina hiyo pesa ningekuwa nayo mm-hmm. hata ingenipea furaha anyway. Mm-hmm. Yes. Wow. Na sasa ukipata mtu wa 620k ili real sasa. Oh. Uh-huh. So you told me I can as per now I no relationship. Yeah. Yes. Maybe akuje tu kama mtu anasaidia. No relation no relationship as as per now. Mm. I just want to give myself time. Mm-hmm. Mm. Wow. So as we wind up ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much. This has been the talk show with Simi Kenya. Hey, tumengangana sana. Na Phoebe amesema zile uh, I mean yale mambo yote ambayo yanaendelea pale nje uh, mingi yao ni <coughs> uongo kwa sababu Phoebe hajakula pesa. Phoebe uh, right now she is not ready for any relationship and of course uh, she has not moved on yeah and uh, you didn't disappoint Jacob by showing up with another man which is uh, which is going round out there so i think up to that point unless we have something that you want to add up finalize oh. maybe to your friends finalizing yeah. as you see those video clip mm-hmm. Jacob had many lies he had many lies mm-hmm. yes from where he works up to his life mm-hmm. for those who know him yeah. he has many lies mm-hmm. yes wow yes na unaonaje tukitafuta jacob pia aseme hiyo oh it's okay it's okay yeah na mnaweza kaa pamoja hivi msi story yeah wewe unaweza kubali i'm okay with that tukileta jacob kuje pande hii wewe ni kuwe katikati wewe ukwe pande hii i'm okay with that sure yeah wow so i think ladies and gentlemen up to that point we will really unless Uh, producer do we have uh, Derek do we have any anything no okay Every, everything is okay yeah. so a very big shout out to everyone who has been watching to our partners and sponsors Fibia memaliza mambo yote mesema you don't have anything to I mean to I don't have anything that I owe to him vitu uh-huh. zenye nilikuwa nazo he came and took them sasa I don't have I think from now people should now yes stop miss putting you or mistaking you they are bullying me social media uh-huh. how do yeah. you how do you feel about that uh, <laughs> it's bad anyway yeah. these people are bullying me na hiyo pesa kuna hey sinewe niliwaambia pesa uongea bibi umesema jakoma kai 620 ke ah kai 620 wacheni kujichocha Men with 620 you see them hata utashtuka you give them respect automatically eh na mimi nakaa hata 50 hivi ah so na job 620 si nusu milioni na guy kwanza unajua watu walipiga hesabu wakasema hata ni wewe ulikuwa unaumia 
kwa sababu walikuwa na kwa hisabu yao eh. ilikuwa inatoka 433 per day <laughs> with this economy so that is i'm struggling with the life ai lakini 433 Maybe this uh, unga ni to 10 hmm? unga ni to 10 si imekula nusu ya pesa si ilianza kama unga ilikuwa 70 ah wewe ni mkula this the current economy ai <laughs> nakonda <laughs> so guys <laughs> guys i think hii mambo ya kuchukua fibi kama mkula pesa i think um, kuna mwenye tuseme you know men are opportunists eh? yeah. uh, have you had people telling you another one au wenye walikuwa wanakutaka kitambo wakisema eh mimi si kuizi mimi mm. sasa sikutaki uta utanifanyia ile kitu no <laughs> no eh? in fact they are proud of me they eh? in real sense they mm. don't have eaten that man in eh? fact they are telling me that congratulations eh? <laughs> congratulations for imagine for the eating that <laughs> amount at it should be 1 million In fact well, they wanted me to, they wanted me to eat 1 million. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hiyo si sasa Jacoma angetembea na mkono. All right. So guys I want us to <laughs> Eh to ladies and gentlemen I think we really need to end the show right now because the show has been smoking hot and smoking fire. We have been live here with Phoebe Okombo and of course Phoebe amewesema uh, venye yeye ni msafi anawekelewa na haugopi that's why amekuja leo uh, kwa show na mambo yake inaendelea kama kawaida bado unaendelea shuleni and uh, you are facing everything out there courageous so mine is to wish you all the best in your studies and of course to wish you all the best in bringing your daughter up well so that at least you can give her the best she deserves Okay. Yes. Yeah. Ama kuna jambo? No. All right. Thank you so much ladies and gentlemen. My name is Simi Kenya. We've been having an amazing moment courtesy of LGGH. LGGH is lovely garden guest home located in Kisumu that is Riyadh. And one good thing is that they give you amazing accommodation. Talk about classy rooms. They have three standards of rooms. They have the standard going at 5500. They have uh, deluxe and they have super deluxe. One thing is that every time you check into LGGH, you will always feel at home. You will always feel like you are home away from home. They have an amazing garden amazing uh, beautiful beautiful garden here beautiful rooms beautiful meals amazing amazing meals kama ile tulipiga lunch eh? kuna lunch nyingine tulipiga hapo ya ajabu kabisa so they give you the best of all that so anytime you feel like you need to have a good time you need to uh, create some memories in the lakeside city of kisumu come to l g g h and whenever you hit the lakeside city of kisumu kisumu is a a uh, place of beauty a place of goodness and of course every time someone comes to kisumu you must always live smiling and talking about smile i mean that is dr shem rakewa dental clinic giving you your smile each and every day and as we always say they are the best certified and tested to make sure that every time you smile every time you laugh you have the confidence that you always wanted so right about now ladies and gentlemen my name is simi kenya thank you so much for before coming to the show of course thank you so much Caleb Asante sana thank you so much uh, uh, my guy there thank you so much my production team Derek Rashid Masi and everyone and th- thank you so much to LGGH for hosting us of course and of course a very big thanks to Dr. Shem Rakewa Dental Clinic for making sure that every time we come on the show we smile and leave our guests smiling so a very big shout out and everyone who has been watching make sure you follow us on YouTube uh, you subscribe to our YouTube channel Simi Kenya TV and uh, follow us on Facebook at Simi Kenya I think up to that point we are done sindio thank you so much may god bless you of course we'll see what comes out of this i know jacom will watch this definitely and of course if he is if he has been watching or if he is, is watching what can you tell him oh yeah what i can tell him uh-huh. achana na drama mm. <laughs> mtu abembelezwe uivo ukitaka mtu you just come face reality ongea na yeye si eti out there kwenda out there and causing drama mi bado ni mi bado mimi ni yule yule lakini kuja tu nikatie tena lakini vipi ni kuulize ulikuwa unataka jakoma kuongelesha aje tuseme sasa wewe ndio jakoma alafu mimi ni wewe eh ungetaka jakoma kuje aje angekuja You can't you can't just come unaanza kushout shout hivyo. Mm. Mwanamke ni kubembelezwa. Alikuja nyama mama na. 
Uh, yeah, something yeah. of that kind. <laughs> Ladies, mwah, men, you can get your more from where you normally get them. We don't care. Of course, say bye bye to our viewers. Oh, bye bye. Uh -huh. Do you love them? Yes. Uh, your friends who have been there for you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And everyone around, let's say a very big thank you. May mm -hmm. God bless you. Ladies, mwah, men, you can get your more from. I, I can see some men here. Just get them from where you normally get them. We don't care. We only care for the ladies because ladies fast. fast. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. May God bless you. My name is Simi Kenya. Of course, thank you so much, Phoebe. May God bless you. Okay, thank you. Thank you.